It can be hard making the right food choices, especially if you're not sure what ingredients are good for you and which ones are bad. And it seems like that's always changing. I'm joined this morning by Cassie Sobleton, a health and wellness expert and author. She knows exactly what's healthy for you and what's not. <laughs> and she's here to help us with uh, eat this and not that tips. Good morning, Cassie. Good Thank morning. you so much for for joining us. And we were just going through some of the items and you know, some of these things are surprising. I had to ask, well, why would you eat that when you're replacing food in your diet? What are ultimately you trying to do? You know, I mean, food can be medicine or it can be poison. Mm -hmm. And at the end of the day, we want to get as much food in our body that is medicine. And so taking out the harmful ingredients and replacing it with something that has all healthy, natural ingredients makes you, you know, every single day be able to put that food into your body and have medicine rather than poison. All right, well, let's go through some of some of the items here. Great. Uh, you want to start down here? Sure, yeah. Kind so, bars, you, you like these. You I love these kind bars. Before. Yep, they're wonderful. So what I love about them is they're all natural ingredients, no preservatives, and they taste amazing. Amazing. So, you know, replacing those unhealthy, maybe protein bars that have a laundry list of ingredients mm -hmm. and probably chemicals and other right. things in them that aren't good for us. These are all natural. You can pronounce every single ingredient in it. And that's when you know something is healthy. When you read the back of it, and you know it's a real food inside of it. Right. You know, I looked at Kind Bars because you brought them on and the only thing that has kept me from switching over mm -hmm. nuts, you know, oh, right. like and lots they, of folks and these have nuts in it. These so. do. Yep. They also have grain bars, which kind are just, grain bars? Yep, the just okay. grain bars. They also have granola bars, which are a great replacement for cereals. Okay. So granola and, you know, a nut milk rather than cereal and regular milk. They don't have all the chemicals. They don't have all the additives. Another wonderful thing, but the grain bars would probably be more appropriate. Then. Okay. Well, thank you because I've looked and I specifically have not bought kind bars because I haven't seen the grain ones, yep. but, but I'll look for that. Great. Uh, we'll, we'll step down here. You look, we work morning hours. Oh, coffee yeah. is our best friend. I love is, my coffee. It's not your father's coffee. No, or it's your mother's <laughs> coffee either. <laughs> this is actually a mushroom coffee blend. And using this with as well a nut milk creamer will really help you be able to get those healthy ingredients and medicine in your body. So mushrooms are very good for us. We know that, but how often do we get them in our diet? Right. So having that mixed into your coffee is a great way to get that into your life. And you know, we, lots of us don't drink enough water. We don't drink enough in general to stay hydrated. That's right. And when we do, we get a lot of extra calories, but that doesn't have to be the case. That's right. And you know, a lot of people like their pop and their diet pop, and that can be, you know, it can have chemicals in it and there are preservatives in there as well. These are a couple options for people who really like that fizz and want to be able mm -hmm. to have it. They're sparkling waters. They come in all different flavors. This is a really great zero calorie root beer that's made with stevia. So stevia is from a plant. It's very healthy for you. It tastes amazing. This one is very similar. It, this is like a um, very similar to a Dr. Pepper taste, but it's okay. called Honest Fizz. Again, zero calories. All right, and we're in, uh, running out of time here. You have some oils. Yep, there's some olive oils here. Um, you know, if you look at the color of this olive oil, it's yeah. so green. This isn't yes. what you normally see. Rallis olive oil, I actually had a chance to go to Greece and see their farm. It was amazing, but the way they make it is slower. They keep all the nutrients in there, the phytonutrients. Mm -hmm. They have a lot of cancer-fighting properties. If you're going to use oil, this should be the type of oil you use. Well, Cassie Sobleton, thank you so much for joining thank us. Thank you. A health and wellness expert and a CEO of Sibella. Yes, Simbella. thank, you. Uh, thank, thank you so you. much for joining us. Uh, coming up in our next half hour, well, we ask viewers